Hey Pisces, I love you guys. Welcome. This is the fourth week of May. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hey you Pisces, I love you guys. There was such a beautiful message from a Pisces lady. She says, I love the way you say Pisces. Yes, I love Pisces people. Okay, you Pisces, let's see what's coming out for you guys. This week is the fourth week of May. The week begins from the 19th until the 25th. And I want to say to each and every person out there, thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. And let's see what's happening. Remember to cross watch to see what's coming up for your partners, your friends, your girlfriend share these videos it's very important okay let's see what is coming up for the Pisces there is definitely an end to a situation that is coming up and this could be the end uh, to someone who was listening to your conversation you young ladies you're at the center of the week and you're definitely being protected okay um, you young ladies are dreaming some of you are dealing with some legal issue or people that is listening to your conversation that is going to be coming to an end okay there could be there's definitely hope and faith that is coming in for you some of you are dealing with our target figure and uh, our target figure is like people who are listening um, who are in government institutes organization or they could be listening to your conversation obviously but that is coming to an end some of you are dealing with um, a young lady and that is listening to your conversation um, be careful of this person because this person could have been in and out of your house placing listening device and that sort of a thing some of you young lady be careful of an Aquarius Gemini or Libra person because they're watching you okay so it could be also that um, um, some of you are being watched or investigate or listened to because definitely I'm seeing this energy, but it's coming to an end. Whoever has placed listening device or on your telephone or whatever, or is listening to your conversation, this is definitely coming to an end. I'm seeing you the young ladies are being very much protected and you are ready for anything that is about to happen. I'm seeing that you no longer stand and hoping and wishing and dreaming in boredom, but you're standing up now and you're moving away from a situation. Some of you young ladies were hurt from a situation. I'm seeing here a situation that is transpiring with um, it could be something at work but it could be something um, uh, 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 so it says you're being protected some of you okay because I'm seeing that um, some of you could be protected by um, your boss or protected from your boss I'm seeing um, it could be a situation where there was some deceptive move at your work okay oh yeah there is some sadness that is coming up so the boredom and the sadness come by the boredom it's as if some of you were bored and so and you're coming out of a sad period and the sadness and sorrows comes up okay so let's see what's happening and what they're saying is that the sadness that you're having it's going to be over soon okay so some of you are coming in this week feeling very sad, but whatever sadness it is, it's going to be over soon. Strong foundation is coming for you. Some of you are building, are going to build a new, some strong foundation in your life. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, whoever this person is, is coming up as a child or that sort of a thing that made you feel sad or put you in a really horrible position, this is ending okay so a double whammy a double whammy with the princess of uh, a princess of one but whoever this person is they come up double so a lot of you are going to be dealing with this person it could be that you were in a relationship or you were married to this person let's see what is transpiring um, some of you could be seeing a younger person you all oh, your yeah, lies and deception some lies and deception is coming out. Whoever this person is, O M K. D is um she is unbelievable. A little line sucker. 
okay but our lies are coming out okay it could be an ex-wife whoever you were dealing with this could be an ex-wife you're gonna be finding out that she has done something okay some of you could have been seeing a younger Pisces cancer or scorpion and she has done some deceptive things and you're going to be finding out I, I said it and there it is so if you are married or was in a relationship with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra um, they found out that you are seeing a younger Pisces cancer or scorpion okay they found out they realize what you have been doing okay all right the nine of wands oh okay okay um, the Knight of Wands, you're protected. Whatever you're going through, you're definitely protected at this time, okay? So if you feel as if you're between the rock and uh, the sea, this is going to be ending, okay? So if you felt as if your life has been, um, you have been going through hardships in your life the last time, you're spiritually protected and this hardship is coming to an end, okay? Then we have the energy of boredom. There is sadness and regrets with a situation, and it has to do with uh, a Pisces, uh, um, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. So it could be that you were in relationship with a younger Pisces, uh, Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. This is coming to an end, okay? Um, whatever it is, and you feel as if. Uh, you're going through pain and hurt because this relationship is leaving your life. Some of you were dealing with um, people um, in authority because the King of Swords comes up. It could be that some of you and the King of Swords is in some problem. He has to pay you, okay? So some of you could have been fighting legal battles. There was definitely legal, legal battles. There was definitely the situation that you had to deal with um, some legalities or some conflicts and you're going to be coming out being very financial stable some of you this person could have been your ex boss and you have to find balance with um, your boss at work you're tired it's as if you're there's so much work and you're just basically tired in the weekend you're finding yourself being tired and trying to balance out situations in your life it is a really heavy week for you Pisces whatever is happening the week is so heavy and I want to ask other questions because here it is some of you have some sadness that you have dealt with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person this person is a younger person than you or it could be someone who is between the ages of 18 and 45 you have regrets dealing with this person for whatever the reason is so here again some of you have been really going through some hardship the last time especially in relationship and some of you if you are dealing with a younger Pisces cancer or scorpion this relationship is going to end because um, you could be ending this relationship with this younger person to go um, with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn some of you have regrets dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn there is it's a sad week for you guys Wow okay new love is coming in and there's hope for this new love so definitely um, and <laughs> okay you Pisces I see what is going on okay some of you Pisces was married to an Aquarius Gemini or Libra or was in a relationship with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra this person have done some deceptive line stuff you are walking away from this person you're definitely making a decision and walk away from this person and um, what is transpiring is that you're returning to a love you some of you have met an older Taurus Virgo or Capricorn lady some of you it could be your mom but it is coming up in a love relationship because here we have the two of cups for some of you um, there is a situation if you were married or you were with someone that have kids for you and they are Aquarius Gemini or Libra 
and you have two kids two daughters the daughter that is the air sign hair sign is going to stick with the mother because the mother has told her lies and deception and she believes it but the daughter who is the pisces cancer or a scorpion or a hurt sign person is going to connect with you so it's as if you have two kids you're you're getting divorced and they're supposed to come and visit you in the weekend but the air sign one is going to stay with the mom and the um water sign one is going to come with you okay um some of you found out that an older person that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn has been the love of your life this person plays a significant role in your life this person really is the love of your life and you're going to be realizing this even though the energy of the lovers card doesn't come out is that you're hoping for a new start with this person it could be a mother figure for some of you but it's coming up as if the universe the angels of guides your angels and guides are orchestrating that you return or they return to you because an intervention was in this relationship and the intervention has to do with your ex-partner that was an Aquarius, Gemini or Libra or a man that is an Aquarius, Gemini or Libra. Okay. Some of you, whoever this person is, you could be getting divorced from this person okay some of you are getting divorced from the water sign people some of you already are divorced from them but they keep on lingering they keep on um, telling the kids lies and, and and that sort of a thing but what is going to happen in this week is that you're going to be finding out that whoever the Taurus, virgo or capricorn person is was meant you both were meant to be and if you have a child and you're going to connect with this older um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person, the child is going to like this person. So let's say you're a man, you're divorced, and your daughter is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. She is definitely going to like you for whatever the reason is. She is definitely going to... Um, like the new person that is coming in your life and the relationship is going to be good and you're going to be feeling happy whatever the hardships that some of you have been going through some of you have placed a taurus virgo or capricorn person through hardship and it could be someone who you have met someone who you your heart space is there for this person. It's like this person is always in your heart, your mind, your body, your thoughts. Whoever she is, she plays a significant role. Whether she's a mother, whether she's a friend, whether she's a, a, a love, but this person has a strong heart space. You have a strong art space. Some of you are connected to a younger Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person, and you have some regrets that you did connect with this person because you realize that this person is not very honest. Okay, whatever the sadness is, it's going to come to an end for you, Pisces. Some of you are going to be finding out that someone that maybe an ex-girlfriend or a friend has intervened in your relationship, okay? Six of Gabriel is here, congratulations. You have done a wonderful job. Time to move on to the next project, awards, scholarship, and promotion. If any of you Pisces out there is thinking about starting a new project, it's a yes. The six of Gabriel is the six of wands. It is yes. Um, go for that project because uh, this project is going to be a success for you. Whoever you are out there and you're thinking about starting you, um, some of you um, 
out there or waiting for a message. It could be a message from a government institution organization. It could be a message about work. It could be some sadness that you're going through. Good message. Something good is about to come out. Some of you who are dealing with the Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra, new love is coming in and this new love that is coming in for you is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. And it's as if the universe of orchestrate that you both connect, okay? Some of you, if you're divorcing an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra man, 45 years and older, um, definitely he has to give you some money. He has to pay you some money. Okay, it is as if something came out and they found out something and he has to pay you some money. Okay, the Ten of Pentacles is here, which meaning it could be um, a divorce settlement, it could be a lawsuit settlement, it could be an injustice that this person has done and he has to pay you some money. What other messages coming out for the Pisces? Um, chaos and conflicts. There is chaos and conflicts that makes some of you sad chaos and conflicts you're dealing with a younger towers virgo or capricorn person whatever and however you have gotten involved with this person there is now some sadness for this person um so some of you could have connected with this person and wanted to do or this person wanted to connect with you or you ask this person to do something but whatever it is however this person have connected with you you realize that it was the worst thing because the tower is going to come and remove this person out of your life and it was a relationship okay it's as if you connect with this person like this person is in love with you but you're not in love with them because you find out that they're not who they you know pretend to be and it's as if they brought some hardship either for your mom. If your mom is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, it's, it's a whole lot going on for you, Pisces. I'm, I'm really hoping and wishing that you guys have a good week because there's a lot going on. Namaste until next time.